Hey bronies, um, I'm I'm sick at the moment. I'm really sorry, but I think I think I kind of have to make this video to help out a few friends. I'll make a future video soon about the convention. But this is this is the official pamphlet for Lost Pegasus Unicon. And not many people have this. The only people who have this are um the people who came in the first day and we're lucky enough to get it. Now what I'm doing here and I hope all of you, I'm asking all of you to retweet this, share it, share it around please. This is for the people who have paid good money, really good money, um, to advertise in a convention that flopped. First page is Aardvark Tees. We have Equestria LA coming up. We also have, um, well, this is convention store, but if you guys can help out, it's Chaotic Brony as well as Toxic Mario. I cannot imagine how annoyed these people must be for having paid for this, these ads, and not got any kind of time to show off. Like, no one saw this. No one saw this. It kills me, so I'm just going to go through the pages of all the ads. All the ads that were not seen because of mismanagement. And I'm going to let all of you see them. It may be a little bit of a boring video, but you know what? They deserve this. I know I'm not doing a whole lot by doing this, but hopefully a few people will see this. And hopefully um, someone much more popular than me. Um, sends out this video. Now, these guys are amazing. Pony plushies. I'm going to personally vouch for them. This is Fluttershy right here. I love pony plushies. They make fantastic, fantastic pieces of art. I, I can't even call this, like, I can't call this, like, a fan creation. This is a piece of art. That's Flutter, and here's Rainbow Dash. And these are just beautiful. So yes, please check them out. And they're really reasonable. It's 80 bucks a pony plush. And um, this is E the Pony Embroidery. Pass this all down. If I miss someone, um, if I miss a page, I'm so sorry. But I'm just trying to do my part. Big Apple Pony Con coming up. Yeah, so this is amazing. Um, just all of these people paid good money to have their wares sold, to have a little bit of advertising, and they didn't get it. So last one is shirts for bronies at the back. So please, please people, remember, not only did they not get their ad scene, um, they paid good money for it. Um, the con didn't have nearly as many people as I expected to. So, I'm going to get off camera because I'm sick and I look horrible, more horrible than I usually do, and trust me, that's pretty bad. Um, peace out. Please share this. Do what you will. People need to know about these great people who advertised in the con booklet, and people should have gotten these pamphlets. Um, as you saw, they were inkjet made. They were very cheap. Um, to me, that's not a big deal because to me, what makes a good pamphlet is information. If the information is in there, you can write it in crayon and I'll be happy. The fact of the matter is there was no information about autograph signings except for how much it cost per person, no time listings or anything, and the schedule of events changed every 20 to 30 minutes anyway. So please guys, please share this, retweet it, uh, favorite it, send it around, get my ugly mug up there so I can toss out this information for these wonderful people. Thank you so much for your time. Peace out, bro hoof.